Rightfully, we think of Moses as a powerful servant of the Lord, a hero in the faith. But like many of us, when Moses was called, he responded to God's commands with excuses. Look, the cry of the people of Israel has reached me, and I have seen how harshly the Egyptians abused them. Now go, for I am sending you to Pharaoh. You must lead my people Israel out of Egypt. But Moses protested to God, who am I to appear before Pharaoh? Who am I to lead the people of Israel out of Egypt? God answered, I will be with you. And this is your sign that I am the one who has sent you. When you have brought the people out of Egypt, you will worship God at this very mountain. But Moses protested, if I go to the people of Israel and tell them the God of your ancestors has sent me to you, they will ask me, what is his name? Then what should I tell them? That's Exodus chapter three, verses nine through 13. We have the tendency to disqualify ourselves. When God gives us a mission, we recount our mistakes. When God gives us an assignment, we hide behind our imperfections. And while it might seem humble to count yourself out, think of the arrogance of saying, I know better than God. Think of the audacity of saying, God's power within me isn't enough to make up for the flaws within me. I love the Lord's response to Moses. God replied to Moses, I am who I am. Say this to the people of Israel, I am has sent me to you. That's Exodus chapter three, verse 14. In other words, all that he is, the all encompassing eternal being, God himself has sent you. Whatever you lack, he doesn't give. Whatever you lack, he is. Whatever your shortcomings, you can go because I am goes with you. No more excuses. It's time to go. It's time to respond to the call of God. I'm David Diga Hernandez, and that is your Moment of Truth. For more free teachings like this, make sure you're signed up to my emailing list so that I can send you weekly emails with content that will help you to grow spiritually. Go to davidhernandezministries.com slash email. Thank you for watching Encounter TV. Don't forget to subscribe and click the notification bell. Also, help us spread the gospel of Jesus Christ in the power of the Holy Spirit. Make a one-time donation or become a monthly supporter by clicking on the donate link now.